A CDC advisory panel says only Americans who want the COVID vaccine should get it after a conversation with their doctor. That same group also recommending changes to the childhood vaccine schedule. Our Washington correspondent, Maddie Beer Temple, reports on the panel's votes and some of the pushback the group has gotten. A group of CDC advisors is reviewing vaccine recommendations for kids. This week, they voted to remove the combined MMR and chickenpox shot from the schedule for children under four, instead advising a separate shot for chickenpox. This is settled science that saved you know, millions of lives that keeps our kids healthy. California Democratic Congressman Ami Barra, a doctor, says the existing vaccine recommendations are safe. Barra says he's concerned the panel members, all picked by HHS Secretary Robert F. Kennedy Jr., will sow doubt in vaccines. Who he's put on there is going to be really dangerous and people are going to die. But other lawmakers like Kentucky Republican Congressman Rand Paul, who's also a doctor, say childhood vaccines do need a closer look. Everybody's alarmed. <laughs> We're going to change the childhood routine. Well, we should. It comes as the panel delayed a vote on whether to stop recommending newborns get vaccinated against hepatitis B, a liver virus. What is the medical scientific reason and proof for giving a newborn a hepatitis B vaccine if the mom is hep B negative. California Democratic Congressman Josh Harder says Americans want to know that science, not politics, is guiding these recommendations. And it makes parents question whether or not this is advice based on medical research or whether or not this is politics coming and saying this is what you should do. Any recommendations made by the panel would need approval from the CDC director. In Washington, I'm Maddie Beertemple.